Green Inn Garden, fresh on table. Welcome to Asian Garden to Table. One of the most well-known Asian vegetables is Chinese cabbage. A lot of people like it, and you can easily buy it in supermarket. But I still strongly recommend you to grow it in your garden. It is very easy, and the most important thing is fresh. The fresh cabbage tastes much better and has more flavor. One month before growing season, start your seeds in seed starter. Chinese cabbage seeds are very easy to germinate. You can sow them directly in your seed starter. For spring cropping, start your seeds indoor until your outdoor temperature is higher than 40 degree. In three to seven days, Chinese cabbage will grow its cotyledon. The best temperature for growing Chinese cabbage seedling is 71 to 77 degree. It will not grow well if temperature is higher than 86 degree. For seed starting in summer, keep your seedling cool by shading and watering. In two to three weeks, Chinese cabbage will grow five to eight leaves, and it is time to transplant into garden. As always, put a lot of organic fertilizer or compost in your garden. I usually use rabbit manure, which I bought from a local farmer. Turn over the soil and bury the manure deep underneath. This fertilizer will provide slow-release nutrients during cabbage's whole growing time. Spray some inorganic fertilizer over top. It will help new seedlings to grow new roots. Chinese cabbage is a cool weather vegetable. The best temperature for growing it is 60 to 75 degree. Even though it can grow as low as 32 degree, but very slowly, and as high as 85 degree, but may have problem with heading. So plan your growing according to your local weather. Place your seedling at least one foot apart. Use tool to dig a hole and bury the seedling plugs in the soil. Some plugs may have multiple plants. You can gently break the plug into two parts. Try your best to make sure each part has some soil and root left. Plant each part into soil as a whole plug. Fully water your seedlings after transplanting. Once Chinese cabbage starts to grow in your garden, it gets into rosette stage and develop layers of leaves. The leaves flat out and cover up the ground. The best temperature at this stage is 62 to 72 degree. Early matured varieties usually grow 16 to 20 leaves in 20 days. While late matured varieties grow 20 to 24 leaves in about 25 days, next is heading stage. In early of this stage, the new leaves grow faster and stand straight up around the center. A lot of nutrients are required to support its growth. So add some inorganic fertilizer, which contains potassium and phosphorus, at the beginning of heading stage, will produce better quality head. The best temperature at this stage is 53 to 72 degree. If temperature is too high, Chinese cabbage may not develop head. After 10 to 15 days, the center of cabbage plant starts to close. From outside, you may not notice the plant is growing much, but actually, new leaves are generating inside the head. The head gets harder. You can start to harvest some of them for cooking. Use your finger to squeeze the cabbage head. The solid one is ready to pick. Head filling takes twenty to twenty-five days. Then Chinese cabbage slows down its growth. The head still gets harder, but much slower. The outer leaves grew in rosette stage, start to turn yellow and dry. If it is in cold winter time, 
The whole plant will get into dormancy, stop growing, and wait for springtime. Pull the whole plant out of the soil. If it is spring cropping, the cabbage needs to be harvested as soon as possible, or the cabbage head will get rotten or grow flower. Chinese cabbage roots are dense and shallow. Cut the roots off and remove outer leaves. The white and solid head is for our cooking. Because Chinese cabbage can be kept at cold weather for so long time, in the north of China, people store them for winter vegetable supply. Chinese cabbage is juicy and crunchy. Fresh Chinese cabbage has a very tender sweetness, which you will not be able to taste it in the cabbage you buy in supermarket. I'm sure you will enjoy that. Here is a quick summary of growing Chinese cabbage. The best temperature for growing Chinese cabbage from seedling to heading trends from mid 70s to 50s. That means autumn cropping will produce the best cabbage because the weather will get cooler by time. There are a lot of varieties available in the market. Some varieties are more heat tolerant and early matured. They will also do well for spring cropping, and with special care, they can even grow in summertime. Depending on varieties, Chinese cabbage growing time can vary from 60 days to 100 days. I hope this video will help you to grow Chinese cabbage. Thank you for watching. I will see you next time.